Hi friends, I'm glad that you've joined me as we begin a new cycle of learning today. Today we will do some decoding. We'll learn more about our controlled vowels. Materials. Let's get our thinking caps on. Here we go. Here are today's learning targets. I can identify how the bossy R changes the vowel sounds in a word. And I can read and spell CVC, CCVC, and CVCC words with an R controlled vowel. Transition song. Sit down and come together, together, together. Sit down and come together, together right now. It's time to make some sounds and blend them together. Let's listen to the sounds now and blend them to make a word. Sounds. We learned that the bossy R can make the OR and R sounds in a word. Today, we will learn about another sound that the bossy R makes. We'll identify the sound and examine the ways that the words are spelled. Knowing the different ways a sound can be spelled will make us stronger readers and spellers. Let's listen to these words now and think about what they have in common. The words are term, church, and bird. What sound did you hear in all three of those words? If you thought that it was the er sound, then you are right. That's the bossy R working again. Term, church, and bird all have the er sound, but it's spelled in different ways. Let's take a closer look. Next to the bossy R, the vowels E, U, and I are called the triplets because they make the same sound, er, when they're next to that bossy R. Let's see if we can find these triplets in other words. Listen for the vowel sound in this word. K, a, b. When I blend those together, the sounds make the word cub. What vowel sound did you hear? This word has the vowel sound a, uh, the short vowel u. But wait, the vowel sound has a visitor. Let's open the door and see who has come to visit. It's the letter R. If we add that R after the vowel u, what happens to the vowel? The R is bossy. It changes the sound a uh, to er. So now the word says k, erb, curb. Transition song. Now it's time to decode words using letter sound connections. Now it's time to decode. Be careful, watch for a change. Word work. Let's make some more words using the bossy R. Pay close attention to the triplet sounds in these words. Listen carefully to the vowel sound. Fern. Fern. How does the R change the vowel in this word? The vowel should sound like eh but not in this word, the R is controlling it. So it makes the sound er. Here's our next word. Let's look at it closely together. J -erm. Germ. What vowel sound did you hear in germ? Again, we hear the er sound, even though we would expect the E to say eh. That R is controlling that E again. So it sounds like er. 
Here is another word with the er sound, girl. We hear the er sound again, but in this word, the sound is made with an ir instead of an er. G -er -l, girl. Let's look closely at this last word, hurl. Listen to the sounds. Hurl, hurl. That means to throw something a very long distance. This time the er sound is spelled with the ur. That r is controlling things again. Remember, when you hear the er sound, it can be spelled with any one of the triplets. ER, UR, or IR. Closing reflection. Nicely done, friends. What did you do today that is helping you to become a stronger, more proficient reader? Excellent work listening for those R controlled vowels today and thinking about those triplets. E-R, I-R, and U-R. I'll see you again soon to continue our learning together.